Labor Day weekend, guys. We're, uh, we're out here scouting for my elk hunt. So, 2019, I've got a CWMU tag here. Um, actually, on the Johnson Mountain Ranch in central Utah. Uh, a lot of you local guys know about the ranch, but I'm lucky enough that I get to um, come up here each year and do some filming of elk hunts with the owner of the ranch and um, super lucky this year that I got a tag in my pocket so uh, main goal for me this year is to do this hunt with my family so I've got my wife and my little girl uh, they've been out here camping with us this weekend having a good time Bridger's been with me he's packing the camera on this hunt so uh, my grand, my, or sorry, Bridger's grandpa, my dad, Larry, and my mom Betty are here, and it's just been a lot of fun. The elk are already rutting. First weekend of September, uh, we've passed on a solid bull this morning, probably 340 class bull that was super hard to pass on, but I don't want it to be over yet. So we've got we had this weekend, and then I've got another weekend towards the end of September. Um, that I get to spend up here, so um, it's gonna be a good time. Follow along. I'm back. Anyway, I just got thinking while I was driving down the road. Uh, a bunch of you guys might not know what a CWMU is. What that stands for is Cooperative Wildlife Management Unit. State of Utah works with private property owners and uh, does an exchange program where uh, the private property owner. Um, lets the state um, draw tags through the draw system like they normally do and then in return the state gives that private property owner uh, landowner vouchers each year that that landowner can do with how he wants he can sell them or he can you know hunt family or friends or whatever he chooses to do so that's basically what a CWMU is um, it is private property. It is not high fenced ranch. Um, the, the fences around this ranch actually have uh, low spots in the fence that are high enough that cows can't get out, but elk can come and go as they want. So um, obviously a lot of elk come onto the ranch because of the pressure from public land and such. So anyway, a little breakdown of what that's all about. Um, it's a pretty special place, I'm sure. Big enough for me to yes, shoot? Yes, it's weaving. You think I should shoot him? It's the first one we've seen. Can't shoot the first one we've seen. Cool. Um, 
called that bull right into me this morning. Still bugling down there, but anyway, we're back on the Johnson Mountain Ranch. Um, I filmed some elk hunters this weekend, but I came in a morning early just to kind of shoot some video, get some screaming bulls on camera. Um, I do have the the old rifle with me just in case something special come out, but the family's not here this weekend, so um, I really want to do it when they're around, so uh, let's go find some more.
Hey. 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 <laughs> What do you think of that? Is that close enough? That was scary. <laughs> I just stared at you. Quick ride back to the four-wheeler. Huh? Quick ride back to the four-wheeler.
Carter, Bridger's behind the camera. We just glassed up a, a really good bull. He's a big mainframe six point with a with a big old seventh uh, in line. So actually got my dad, he's back on the spot and scope, kind of keeping an eye on him. We're gonna hike in here and try to get him. Plug your ears, Carter. Dad. Plug. That's a big one. Are you ready? Yeah. You guys You're recording? Yeah. yeah. That's not a good shot, though. Oh. I'm ready anyway. Anyway, he's brought to it. How many range him again? Yeah. Are you zoomed in good? 345. Yeah. 348. I'm ready you are. That's a big bull. Turn sideways. Holy smokes. We can pound him right there. I'm ready when you are. Okay, you good? Yep. Jailed him. Cock another one in. He's dead. He ain't moving. <coughs> Holy smokes. Your ears okay, Carter? It's loud, huh? How do you like being on your first elk hunt with dad? <laughs> huh? He's awesome, isn't he? Big old inline seven right there. Come grab him. 
No way. Guys to the elk. This couldn't have turned out any better. I was able to have the family here with me tonight. I was able to take this awesome bull. Um, like I've told you guys, I've filmed hunts here with Bob Thomas, the owner of the Johnson Mountain Ranch for about five years now. And he um, offered me a tag this year. So I wanna tell him thanks. Um, we started out uh, you know working together more or less but me and Bob are now I consider him one of my best friends so a uh, pretty special place it's amazing to come chase elk here every September love him